gotta be serious about this game. I don't care if you go broke trying to do this game. It gotta be that. It has to be an eat, sleep, and breathe. If you don't have that, get out the game. We hit every club. Everybody knew. We knew everybody in three months. Because we were out every night. And even my mom was like, this don't seem like you're working. It seems like you're at a party every night. That's work. Going to a party is work. I have to go out there and get to know who people are. They got to know who I am. And that's how my clients started getting jobs. And I had huge clients. I was blessed to have huge clients. We just started working like crazy. So you have to not just sit at home and expect, oh, I'm tired tonight. Well, guess what? The person that's not tired, they out. They met the right person. And now they're working. So just be serious about this. I'm, I'm serious because a lot of times I meet people like, oh, I just want this business so much. And then I just ask them a few questions. You haven't gone to one industry event in one month? There's an industry event every night. Now I'm not saying you have to be out on the street every night, but you should at least monthly be going to industry events to meet people. There's a lot of things for free. There's a lot of workshops, seminars. Y'all in Atlanta, this is the mecca of Hollywood right now. Hollywood is just a name, because Hollywood ain't the mecca anymore. They're shooting more productions here than anywhere in the country. So I should never meet anybody from Atlanta ain't working. Mm. If y'all don't know Andrea, get to know her. She's working, how many projects are <laughs> she working on right now? <laughs> okay, she's always working. Get to know some people in this room. You're casting bands on projects right now. Are you casting yeah. Saturday? Get to know people. There's no reason why nobody should be working. Even if you're assistant, let that pride go. Mm. I hate when I meet people proud because I look at them like, I had a bachelor's, master's, and law degree, and I was assistant mm. when I first started producing. Ooh. So don't talk to me what you can't do. You ain't gonna see those credits now on my IMDb. But that's what I started doing. You know, I was working for Susanna Paz, I was working for different people, and you just do what you have to do because you gotta learn. And let me tell you something, assisting, you're gonna learn more than anybody. Because you're gonna see all the emails, you're gonna be answering all the phone calls, you get to know everybody. Because they're gonna know who you are. A lot of times you gotta talk to the assistant before you can get to another person. So don't be that prideful where you're like, I don't wanna do this. Because you understand the ro that might be the road you have to take to get here. So just let all that go. Because I'm going to tell you, everybody who's made it, they've done some things or they've been in situations where they're living in their car. Whatever they had to do to get to their dream. So I want y'all to keep being dreamers. Be fearless. You're special. You're designed. The industry is for us right now. It's not by accident that almost everything of color that we touch is going to the top. It's not by accident. Not by accident. Black Panther was the highest grossing movie for Marvel. It's not by accident. You know what they say? The head becomes the, the tail, or the tail becomes the head. Whatever they say, y'all know what I'm saying. <laughs>